Chef Paul Lindsay from The Porch has been kind enough to give up one week's pay to huh. give 20% off of everybody's bill when they Well, that's come. good because it's not a lot, so. <laughs> oh, come on now, come on now. I'm super excited that you've been here this morning because The Porch just opened um, just last uh, Thanksgiving, right? Correct. So you guys are um, building up your clientele now and letting we are. everybody know we are. you're around. Yeah, we're, we're doing some menu changes. Uh, I'm gonna roll out another menu probably in about a month. Oh. Um, the summer is a great time to do So you're tests. getting me all excited about this menu? None of this is changing. Okay, good. Because this is the brunch menu, this right? This is the brunch. Okay, tell me about brunch. Now, brunch goes on, uh, is it Saturday and Sunday? We do Saturdays and Sundays. Okay, what time? And we do 10 until 2. Ooh, that's a nice brunch. And it's a good mix of lunch items as well. So if you're not an egg fan, we, we definitely have some options for you. On Excellent. There. Healthy options as well. Okay, and so, you have $15 bottles of champagne. We do. Okay, you had me at champagne. Okay, so now you're making for us, we did a protein bowl, we did a rolled omelet, now we're making a breakfast Sammy. Yeah, just easy, super classic, these awesome English muffins. Those are, are beautiful English muffins. Look how big they are. So they're from City Bakery in Mesa. Oh, okay. Love and you those toasted guys. them up? Yeah, real nice toast on them. A little butter, is that what you use? Uh, I actually used a little bit of olive oil. Oh, okay. Is and that then, better than butter? Do you think? In certain applications. You, you well, know, for toasting getting, your buns, what would you recommend? I, I think so, or clarified butter is okay. the best. Okay. There's no milk solids in it. Okay, good to know. So we're just gonna do just sort of a, a, a little sloppy scramble, if you will. And then we're gonna do some awesome natural um, smoked cheddar Ooh. on top. I'm gonna give it a little fold. We're making it into a sandwich, so it's not important for the appearance of the eggs right now. Right, right. Go ahead and let that, that do your thing right there because I want to show, um, if in case you missed the first segment, he made this amazing protein bowl, which is always on the menu, right? It is, yes. And, and the rolled omelet, always on the brunch menu. Always on the brunch menu. Okay. And then um, the little little Sammy that we're doing here. I yeah, like that. so for this one, I'm also going to use the harissa. You could certainly So is use, it really spicy, super spicy? Um, it's a very sort of earthy spice. It builds, it doesn't get too crazy oh hot. It doesn't build after you continue to eat it. It's different than a jalapeno or a Fresno. It doesn't build, really? <laughs> Apparently that was spicy. <laughs> Apparently that was spicy. A little bit. It's all good. It's Sorry good. I like it. I like that. it. Okay, and so you're gonna, ooh, all right. So we're gonna do a little bit of the harissa on this. You could mm. use, you know, sriracha. You could use a little bit of, um, you know, chalua or things like that. So as with the omelets, we're gonna make this Really big. Yeah, you are, because it's a really big English muffin. And then we do some awesome bacon, and then we're gonna do some avocado. You have awesome bacon and amazing eggs. Have you noticed that? Yes, <laughs> of course. <laughs> Always finish with salt and pepper when you're using avocados. Really, why? Because it enhances the flavor. I did not know that. Yeah, here's some awesome Local fresh fruits. <laughs> awesome local fresh fruit. See? Awesome eggs. Amazing. Trying to be positive. Amazing, amazing avocados. All right. Hey, quick.